happy first day of school. Yay. All right, peeps, so I just woke up. It is 9.30. I don't have class till 12.30, and guys, I didn't even try to plan it like that. That's just the earliest time I could get. So that makes me happy because I'm a night owl and a morning person, but I don't want to be getting up for 8 a.m., so 12.30 is good. I literally didn't go to bed till 4.30 last night because I was trying to, like, get my room situated. It's taken me so long to, like, get everything organized. I finally got it. I just have a few more things, but for the most part, it's organized, but... I'm gonna get up, start my day. Happy first day of 15th grade. To the bathroom I go to wash my face. Look at my cutie bathroom. I got this little scent thing. So this is making my bathroom smell really nice. The camera's so broken, I literally just fixed it with tape. Da -da -da. It's time to get an outfit. Gloop. I don't know what to wear. It's so dang hot outside that it's like, I melt whenever I walk outside, so I need to just wear, as as much as I don't want to wear running shorts, I feel like I need to because I'm going to just melt into a puddle of goop. And let's just put the blinds, which way does it go? The blinds open so that, ew, this is a fail. Let's do a cool transition. I seriously hate not dressing up, but I literally, I think it's like 2,000 degrees outside. Now I'm gonna make my bed. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I never do this, but since it's the first day of school, I figure we should start on the right note. And maybe this will make me do it more often. Oh, also one of my plant things that was hanging up fell in the middle of the night. I have to put that back up, but it scared the bejesus out of me. Good thing is, I have a Betty, so it just zips up. So convenient. I'm gonna have to figure out the aesthetic of this later. So, time to do the maquillaje. Okay, I ended up changing. I don't know why, I wasn't feeling that other outfit, so this is probably not the best idea to wear gray because I'm gonna be sweating, but this is a little crooked and I don't think I should be cutting it like this, but like, do you see? That's lopsided. I'm gonna cut it. <laughs> I think that's a little better. I'm not sure. We're just gonna go with this because I don't really know what else to wear. So here it is. All right, laptop needs to go in backpack. Um, I, a lot of people ask, okay, this is really hard to do with one hand, but a lot of people ask what I use to take notes and I just use my laptop. Sometimes, occasionally I'll do it by hand if like the class wants me to or whatever, but I just like taking notes on my laptop, so. That's what I do. I'm also bringing my external hard drive because I have to edit a few videos. I put some gum in here because I literally can't live without gum. I've got some pens, my AirPods. Oh, I have this, which is gonna be a lifesaver. It's for your phone. You like plug it into your phone and it fans you. All right, I think I have everything. Goodbye room. See you soon. Now it's time to make some coffee. Look at my cutie place. I don't know where everything is now because, uh, where's my, cup? oh there it is, this is the coffee I drink, International Delight, I can't say it, International Delight Vanilla, it's really good. Uh, oh my gosh. Here's my coffee, first day of junior year folks. Let's get it. Oh my gosh. Like, I'm scared to sling my backpack around because my coffee is gonna explode everywhere. Look how cute our little key hook is. I got it from Amazon. All right guys, now comes the fun part of the day, finding a parking spot. So like I said, I applied for a UJ parking spot and I didn't get one. There were three rounds that they could like give you spots and I didn't get one for either round, for any of the rounds, so, so sad. So now, and I even called them and I was like, hey, listen, I'm a junior and I'm commuting, like, 
is there any chance I'm gonna get a spot? And she's like, no, there's no chance. Which is just so weird to me. Like, you'd think that commuters would have first priority. I don't know. But anyways, I haven't even looked at my schedule. I'm pretty sure they're both in the same building, but <laughs> I don't know what room number, so we're about to, we're about to find out. Well, just as I suspected, no spots. Wait, there's one right there, but then I have to parallel park. And I don't want to parallel park. Can I park up there? Is this allowed? I think it is. Is that a spot? I'm confused. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to park here. It doesn't say I'm not. See, this is the problem with having like a bright yellow car. It's like, it's just in your face. Yellow. Just finished. Where am I? It says my class is on the fourth floor. There's no more stairs. Oh, I see. I just finished my first class. Oh, this is really awkward. And now I'm going to my second class. I think this is my class, but I'm not sure. My, um, I'm going to switch to flying. She said it was really good. I know nothing. Yeah. Any holidays that you need off for, let me know. Number four. Getting out of class on the following class. So I just finished up that class. I'm so confused. Oh. Now I'm gonna go to Tate to do homework. Guys, I missed campus so much. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be back. I uh, look at look at me. My car just is weird. Like I look like a train wreck. Oh, not a good day to wear gray, folks. Not a good day. Oh man. But I actually, well, I actually, I looked a lot worse than this. Uh, like 10 minutes ago, but I've been in my car for a while cooling down. I have something really exciting to show y'all. Okay guys, so I am back in my room now and I had a great day of school. I want to tell y'all about this website called Syllabuddy. So if you know me, like I don't do sponsorships or anything unless I literally like think that the product or website or anything like that is really great and can help y'all. And this is a perfect example because I know how hard it is, like especially for us college students, when we go to the first day of school and we get about a billion different syllabi handed to us and they're all laid out differently, they all say different things, it's very confusing and can be very overwhelming. So what I love about Syllabuddy is you literally upload your syllabus to the website. You don't even have to download anything. It's just on a website, which I will link down below. You literally just upload your syllabus. It extracts all of like the due dates and everything from that syllabus for you literally in a matter of seconds and then it can import it to your Google Calendar your uh, Apple Calendar it is amazing so I want to show y'all how it works because it is now that time where I have to go through all my syllabi and make sure that I know when all the due dates are because I do not want to get behind so I'm going to show y'all how it works. So this is the Syllabuddy website. It's very awesome. So literally you just upload your syllabus and instantly get organized. So this is how it works. You upload your syllabus. It extracts the dates, the homework and the exams and all that. And then it imports it into your schedule. So I'm going to go ahead and do my ADPR 3400 syllabus first. So literally that was so quick. So this page doesn't have any tasks on it. Neither does this one. It literally scans through them and sees which pages have tasks. So when you finally get down here where there's like the actual calendars and everything, look at all of this amazingness. So it literally puts it all into organized little sections for you to know what content and what quizzes and all that stuff is due on which date. Isn't that literally insane? And just say you wanted to like add some important notes or something to any of these, you can literally just click edit and you can add whatever you want. So like. I could say, oh, this is very important. So if you want to send yourself this and put it in your calendars, you just type in which course name it is, and then you're going to type in your email address. So then once I get the email, you literally just click this little attachment down here, and you click allow, and then it gives you all of the assignments, and then I'm going to click add all, and I'm going to click work, and they're all going to be in there. 
there it is so I just think this is so amazing and it's gonna be so helpful I will link syllabuddy down below definitely go check it out and upload all your syllabi to it and it'll just make your life so much easier so thank you syllabuddy for reaching out to me and for showing me this amazing website I'm so grateful so that is it for my first day of school vlog I really hope y'all enjoyed it please comment down below what videos y'all want to see from me please subscribe that would mean the world to me and I will see you all in my next video bye everyone have a great day Hand hug. Ooh, hey.